Are you ready to take an unforgettable journey to Greece? What you have been waiting for so many months is finally here. The blessed land of the gods is being revealed in front of your eyes. Summer holidays in the most exotic part of Europe, Greece. Castles and picturesque medieval ports. Authenticity traditions and rich history, untouched virgin nature, good weather and sunshine, relaxation and delicious local cuisine. Exciting adventures and powerful moments in Greece, an endless open-air museum. Hello travelers, my name is Anastasios Grecos and you are watching Turismo's Travel Guru channel. In today's episode we travel to the magical world of Nafpaktos. Do you like the video? Now there is an easy and fun way to help us produce more free content and quality travel guides for your summer vacation. You can also buy me a coffee by clicking the link in description, like this video, subscribe and share with your friends, enchanting destinations and fascinating stories. Built in the shape of an impressive amphitheater, Nafpaktos will steal your heart from the very beginning. It is one of the oldest Greek cities that experienced periods of great prosperity and was associated with important historical events. It is located in the southwestern mainland, in the Tolia Carnania region, famous for its diverse landscape with wetlands and blue lagoons, a rich fertile valley, sea and lakes and rivers. At the end of the video you will find detailed maps of the area. Nafpaktos lies 217 km west of Athens and 23 km northeast of Patras, the main port of the Peloponnese. It has almost 13,000 permanent residents and used to be called Lepanto by the Venetians. Nafpaktos is a beautiful city with a long history. It is said to have taken its name from the words Naus and Pegnemi, meaning to build a ship. It is mentioned for the first time in 1104 before Christ, during the descent of the Heraclitae Dorians, a Greek tribe. Due to its strategical location, controlling access to the Gulf of Corinth, Nafpaktos was an important Athenian naval station in the Peloponnesian War. It changed hands many times during the Crusades and the Ottoman-Venetian Wars. Here took place the Battle of Lepanto in 1571, a decisive victory by the Holy League against the Ottoman Empire. Among those who fought was Miguel de Cervantes, the most famous Spanish writer. There is a statue located at the port in his honor. Enjoy your walks around the medieval port of Nafpaktos, exploring the secrets of the past and the aromas of the present. Cafés and Tavernas Traditional mansions and guest houses walls and statues, a mosque and a lighthouse, sea breeze and the Greek blue everywhere. The main square above the port is a real hotspot and meeting point. The surrounding streets and alleys of Nafpaktos are ideal for romantic walks or jogging. Discover the clock and the imposing Venetian castle of Nafaktos, with its strong fortifications overlooking the bay. The images are simply breathtaking.
Astro Cafe is the best place to relax and enjoy a unique environment and view. Outside the walls of Navpaktos, you will feel like a pirate, while enjoying a refreshing swim under the Greek sun. Gribovo and Psani beaches are located east and west of the port respectively. Further east we find Hiliadou Beach and Monastiraki, an exotic paradise. Trizonia Island is a little known destination and a wonderful excursion. Next stop Orini Navpaktia, the mountainous region of Navpaktos with remote traditional villages and authentic virgin nature warps your attention. Antirio is the place where the glorious past meets a miracle of modern mechanics. The medieval castle of Antirio lies next to the Rio Antirio bridge, connecting the Peloponnese with the western mainland. Built in a special and advanced way in one of the most seismic active areas in Europe. And finally the sacred town of Mesolonghi, a dramatic siege, the death of poet Lord Byron, the Greek heroes, the salt lakes and blue lagoons, a protected environmental park, an important ecosystem famous for its rich bird and fish life, flora and fauna. This was another lovely journey to the beauties of the unexplored and authentic face of this Mediterranean country. The ideal place to recharge your batteries. Paradise on Earth has a name and is located in Greece. Was this presentation useful? Tell us your opinion. Share it with your friends. Thank you very much and subscribe for more videos, unique landscapes and exotic beaches.